question today is, is PC gaming dead? And absolutely not, according to this survey. This survey was conducted by the Entertainment Software Association. Now this is the biggest association of publishers and developers in the United States. It's not some sort of jag off website, right? Are you sure? Not, I'm positive, you can check it up. Check the link in the underbar. The, the stats are, they, they, you had to fill the questionnaire. A bunch of gamers had to fill the questionnaire on their survey and they had to you know click what applied to them so if you had a pc and a console and a smartphone you select those three now i'm just going to show you the bar chart right here and as you can see you clearly see consoles are at 68 percent pc is a close second at 63 uh, percent smartphones is at 43 percent handhelds 37 percent and finally wireless devices at 30 percent now this is kind of not jiving with all the surveys that are saying that PC sales are going down, no one's buying PCs anymore, everyone's playing on smartphones and tablets. So what's happening here? I'm sorry, my belly was a rumbly. What do you think's happening here? Do you think people are just keeping their PCs and they're buying these new gadgets and they're updating their PCs and that's why we're not mm. seeing the sales? Or what's happening? I people think are lying? No, but I think that like 20% of the PC sales is also going into games like Farmville. Like so like social media. You're saying 20% of people who are saying they game on PC are saying, yeah, it's some mother in Idaho. Going, that's that's a going, possibility. Going like this. Oh, yeah, that's a hamburger. But oh. don't you think that that like handhelds and smartphones and like other wireless devices, no. like tablets, like mothers would be all over that no, shit. No, the the thing about gaming is this: video games are for consoles, mm -hmm. right? That's what a console is. It plays video games. A PC happens to do everything. It also plays games really well. Some might argue better than on a console. Yeah. But I don't think that a mobile phone and a gaming console should ever have went together. I understand the need to play these little games on your on your mobile, like I'm on the subway, I want to waste some time. I still, still to this day, I just downloaded Deus Ex The Fall. Amazing game on, on the portable, but or on, on, on an iPad. On, on a, a smartphone. Yeah, it's on my iPhone. Um, it's an amazing developed game, but guess where I really want to play it? I want to play it on my console. I don't care about this shit. What happens if they got, if you got like, uh, down the line, you got like a Bluetooth controller that syncs with your iPad or something like that? Yeah, I got, well, I got something already. It's called a PS4. Right. That's what I'm going to have down the line. Right, so I think that's why it says here that, you know, consoles are still in the lead. Very not too far, yeah. pieces are second. So it seems like these new gadgets are not changing much. No, but I wonder not. if they do this survey in five years when people are like, man, instead of buying a PC, kids, why don't we just buy a nice tablet? It doesn't add up to me. I still don't, I don't believe that it's gaming. It's not gaming to me. Just because it's a game that you can play on a mobile device doesn't make it a game to me. Like it, it's something else, there's something else to it. it. It goes back to gaming in general. Gaming in general is like, about playing on a couch with some people, mm. beating each other's scores. That's essentially what gaming was. And now we're getting things like, I see people on the bus not looking outside at the world, all of them, all 30 people on the bus looking at their phones like, what is the status update? I think we're losing touch in those gaming companies that think, oh, I'm gonna make billions of dollars. I think one day these mobile companies are gonna go down. What about games that integrate smartphones and tablets are going to in like these next gen games. I no, wait, 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 wait. These games that like, you know the, those parts of like a driving game where you customize no, your I get car? It, I get it, yeah. No, 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 wait. You know yeah. when you customize your car and stuff and your character? Imagine if you could do that on your iPad or your phone at work. That's stuff that you don't really want to do. You just Because when you get home, you just want to play. Well, that is what is coming. But don't you think that's interesting? That's a totally when... different case because that's me extending my game from my home console to at work. That's yeah. to me is fun. But to play a puzzle game on the go and call myself a gamer is totally different. Okay, and you know what I also think is interesting? What would this survey look like, or this bar chart look like, if they did this survey during the Steam summer sale? I wonder if the PC would be just skyrocket past the, the consoles. Well, of course it would, because all the games are half off. Right. 75% off, like, the numbers would just be jaded. And the reason why the percentages don't add up to 100%, they add up over, is because some people, like myself, have everything. I have a PC, I have a console, so, of course, they checked off those boxes, right? So that's why, so I don't want you guys to be confused when you see that bar chart. Um, so yeah, tell us what you guys think. Are you guys playing on PC, console, smartphone, tablets, all of them, or just two? Let like, us know. Are you buying into these, like the Deus Ex The Fall? Are you really buying it? Are you maybe buying it? Are you that hardcore of a fantasy? Like, oh, maybe it's an extension of the game. 
I'm gonna have a good time with it. So it's a cockpool. I guess so. It's a tease. It's like a it's a, mo see, it's could, a supermodel with AIDS. You could see they can make a good game, yeah. but they're making it on yeah. the wrong platform. Yeah, right? well, so it is a exactly. cockpool. It's a supermodel with AIDS. Supermodel with AIDS. You see her. But let's be wander. honest. I'd fuck her. Well, when you got AIDS and you get AIDS, you don't get more AIDS. I thought you were gonna say when you got it, you gotta keep it. Thank you for watching this news bites. Do you want more news bites? Because we'll do them. Let us Michael, know. We'll do them. Yeah. Okay. Bye, guys. Bye.